right, first normalization cycle. All right, first normalization cycle is over. How do I know that? Because I can pick it up by my hand. Okay, so it's time to go back into forge, get it back up to non-magnetic, and let it cool one more time. All right, keep you posted. Okay, I gotta heat up the oil before I can quench. Yeah, it's been about 19 degrees. That's probably not a good thing. So, I'm gonna heat up the oil. We've already done the last blade standing. It has been normalized twice. Right at non -mag non magnetic. I'm going to just leave it a bit more than that, and then it's ready for the switch. Then we're going to put it in my uh, straining jet. You want me to stop it? No. Nope. All right, here we go. Switch time. No, I'm not going to make a fireball. Okay. Dark, no fireball. All right, now to the jig. get questions about the straightening jig. Oh, it's not necessary. Well, wearing a seatbelt isn't necessary, but when you need it, you want it. Same thing here. I don't know if it's going to bend or not. This will help when it's cooling to keep it straight. It's not going to warp really wide, whoa, 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 all over the place. It should hopefully be straight. Might still have a little wibble, wiggle in it, but I can grind that out. So, all right, we'll see if it survives the temper cycle. All right, it's been in the straightening jig for about five minutes. Now we're going to take it out and take straight up the temper, temper cycle. I'm using the, the kitchen oven set at 400 degrees. We're going to do that twice, two hours each time. So still warm, but it's straight and it's a hard blade. All right, in the temper cycle.